All right, so we're gonna do an update on baby number three, or as I like to call this child, ta-da! So, ta-da is now been cooking for nearly 12 weeks. So we are almost out of the first trimester, which is pretty awesome, because here lately, my wife has been like uber sick. Like, she don't feel good at all. She is not having a good time. And she gets like morning sickness at night. So, she's good all the way up till about 5, 4.30, 5 o'clock, about time it's supper time. And then, she just don't feel good no more. She gets sick, and that's it. That's the end of the day. You know, she don't, she can't really do much after that. You know, because she's, she just don't feel good. So, ta-da, I'm convinced is a boy. I'm still convinced it's a boy. I've been convinced it's a boy the whole time because Tadai's heart rate is lower than the girls. I've got two other girls and they hovered right around the 168 range. 168, 172. They kind of both stayed right about there. Tadai has been right around 144 to 150. Now I don't know. I think that genders do actually have different heart rates I'm not a hundred percent sure but I think that they do actually have different heart rates um, so I'm thinking this is a boy I'm thinking the slower heart rates a boy you know I could be wrong uh, but my thought process is that uh, boys are less stressed and put more stress on their mothers I know that I am less stressed and my mother was more worried about me than my sister uh, when we were younger because I was, you know, meaner and wilder and did things and went out. And my sister, you know, didn't do any of that. Um, and yet my sister was more stressed than I. So that's kind of the basis that I have to go off on that. I don't think there's any truth to that, but that's my theory right now. Um, in any case, back to ta-da. Tada is uh, making his mama feel bad. Still convinced it's a boy. Making his mama feel bad. And is not having fun. And so because the heart rate's lower and my wife feels bad at night, which with our middle child, our youngest daughter, she felt bad. My wife felt bad like the entire time. But I think that the more she feels bad with this child is more severe um, she feels bad worse uh, when she does feel bad so at the five o'clock mark she feels bad she feels worse than she did throughout the entire day with our middle child if that makes sense so another reason why I'm convinced that it's a boy is because he's doing this to his mother because boys are mean to their moms I don't know why um, uh, my mother-in-law said uh, They'll step on your toes when they're little, and they'll step on your hearts when they're bigger. So, that's, you know, back to my thought process. Also, if, when you get older, and you are, you have to go to, like, the nursing home or assisted living facilities, girls or your female children are more apt to spend time with you when you hit that age. That's an actual proven fact. That's an NCLEX question, actually. NCLEX, for you nurses out there. That was an NCLEX question. If that comes up, who, which child will see the parent more? The answer is the daughter. Uh, it, it was four years ago. So, should still be the answer today. Anyways, back to my point. That's why I think it's a boy, because my wife feels worse, the heart rate's lower, my wife feels bad at night. You know, just thinking it's a boy. You know, old ta-da. I just think he's a boy. Uh, I changed the camera around. Put it on this side. I hope it works better. I'm kind of trying to get used to looking around the camera. Um, if you like it, cool. If you hate it, let me know. I'll put it back over there. Um, what else do I got? Oh, folks that's commented on stuff. Like, you know, pray for me. I'm going to nurse school. You know, I got my NCLEX coming up. Let me know. Did y'all pass? You know, are you, you know, first semester nursing school, now second semester? Did you pass nursing school? Did you flunk out? You know, I don't want you to flunk out. Did you flunk out? Did you pass? Did you pass your NCLEX? Are you taking the NCLEX again? You know, 
If you got a job now, let me know. It'd be cool to, you know, it'd be cool to know that people are, you know, doing good. So, I hope it helps. I do thank you. And maybe I'll get a video tomorrow, maybe not. I've been a little bit slack on the videos. I'm working two jobs now. And, you know, with the expecting of our third child, uh, kind of going to doctor's visits and stuff. Uh, also, I'm coaching soccer for my oldest child and I'm helping out with community organizations. So time's getting a little bit limited, but I'm gonna try to keep on making videos. I uh, hope it helps. Thank you much. I don't know where my watch is. Oh, I bet that's what fell the other day. I'll do it this way then.